Dean DeCosta, and today we're going to talk about a tool that's actually a Chrome add-on. And in the advent of Facebook making changes to its graph search and actually doing away with it and making it much harder to find people on it, uh, this tool becomes even more prevalent. Uh, key is you need to make sure you're signed into Facebook, although Facebook isn't open. I do have my uh, Facebook notifier down here, and I am signed in. The tool sits right here. It has this icon. It's called UID Extractor. Great tool. If you push the button, you'll notice that it has status, collected, download UIDs, download email, start, clear all, download, whatever. Uh, this is a free version, so keep in mind you're limited to 100 ID or email downloads, but that's just fine because that's not even the part of the tool we're going to look at right now. We're going to look at this part down here where it allows you to find people. The first thing we're going to look for is people who currently live in, and I live in Seattle, so we're going to pick Seattle. Then we're going to look for, in this case, current job. We're going to look for titles. We're going to put developer. Uh, then I'm going to add another current job, only this time instead of an actual title, we're going to put a company. In this case, we're going to put Amazon. And then we're going to put the uh, search button. Now you'll see it opens up a separate window where it actually has done this search for me. And you'll notice all these people are developers. They all live in Seattle and they all are working at Amazon. Fantastic tool. It just did what we needed to do and what Graph Search used to do. Now, the extra for the tool. The extra now is you can go in here based on the fact you're here. We're going to download emails. The UIDs won't help me much and we're going to push start. And as you can see, this number is counting. It's actually downloading the Facebook emails for all these people. And as you know, uh, unless you opt out, a, a if you send an email to a Facebook email, it will get to their personal email. 90% of the people do not opt out. So this is a very, very viable uh, solution to finding emails. Now, I stopped it because I didn't want to keep going, but it would have gone indefinitely. We're now going to download them. Uh, you'll notice right down here, we're going to open it, and it comes out to this nice, pretty little text doc with all of their um, Facebook email addresses. Now, if you've watched my video on finding emails where I say that, uh, and I make clear that most people, when they use a username for a social site, they use it for multiple social sites, and just as importantly, they probably have an email address associated with it, i.e., in this case, Andrew Paradesh J probably has an email address with that same um, username at, say, Hotmail.com or MSN.com or whatever. And if you watch that video, which is on recruiting tools, it will explain to you how to figure it out. But here you go. Copy, paste, stick it in an email, send it, and you're good to go. Now, here's where you get a little bit extra. If you use this other tool here, which is called Facebook Email Scraper, and you push it, you're here. Now it's starting, and right now it's found 80, so we're going to download these. This is where it gets cool. We're going to open this document. It's a zip file. You see two of them. The first zip file is email. Same thing we've already gotten. The second zip file, though, are the full all the information you found on a person. Their Facebook you, um, number, their name, their Facebook um you are um, URL all the way down to live in Seattle from Wisconsin all this good stuff and they're a developer at uh, at um, Amazon all the way down here this is all about Andrew the next one is Greg so now you can cut and paste put this in a nice Excel spreadsheet add in the emails and you have a nice uh, Excel spreadsheet full of people that you can um, contact and do what you got to do with. As you can see it's even finding more. It didn't stop at 80. I'm stopping it because frankly I don't want any more. So this is a great tool. It does what you need it to do. And, 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 and it, like I said, the big key deal is the UID extractor does allows you to do the searching and then downloading the actual emails. And if you want to do more, then the Facebook email scraper will allow you to do even more. So you combine these two tools, you got a great set of tools that will allow you to continue to work on Facebook to download what you need and to get the job done.